Hi everyone, my name is Rishi. I'm the co-founder of Digital Scholar and today on Success Story, we have a very special guest from Batch 12, Sara Shifa, who cracked an amazing uh, package and also she's going to be sharing her experience about uh, Digital Scholar. So welcome to the show. Hi everybody, you're welcome. Thank you so much. Thank you, Rishi sir. So awesome. I'm so, so glad that I came across Digital Scholar. I'm like really, really happy. Yeah. And uh, so tell us about your background, where do you come from, uh, what do you do your uh, schooling or college from? So I'm basically from Bangalore. Uh, I finished my graduation from Christ University, Bangalore. I'm a BCom graduate. Okay. After that, I did my MCom. Okay. And I started to, uh, you know, counsel students for study abroad. So I was, a I, I was an education co consultancy. It was an education consultancy and I was a consultant there. Okay. So when uh, we were, uh, you know, uh, counseling the students, uh, it was a very small company, so we had to prepare uh, posters and we had to post it on social media. That is when my interest towards digital marketing started, that is two years mm -hmm. back. Mm -hmm. So uh, that is when I chose a digital marketing field. And okay. then I took up a course. It was a very, uh, you know, in my uh, uh, locality, like, you know, but then lockdown happened and I did not find that really helpful. Um, so I was practicing uh, digital marketing uh, as a freelancer, but not like, you know, small projects, like just poster designing and just posting on the social media and everything. Hmm. And then uh, me and uh, I got married. I uh, had to shift to Ramnagar. It's an outskirt from Bangalore. Okay. And uh, me and my husband were sitting and discussing. So he asked me, so what do you want to do next? So, uh, so I said, I'm going to pursue my career in digital marketing. That's for sure. I want to get into digital marketing because, you know, I have uh, interest towards it. So right. he said, okay, so then let's look up for courses. Mm -hmm. So that is when I started to, uh, you know, Google digital marketing classes online because okay. I didn't want to travel all the way from uh, Ramnagar to Bangalore. It's, it's quite far and there are no uh, institutes who teach uh, digital marketing here around. Right. So when I started to, uh, you know, look for digital marketing uh, classes, mm -hmm. so Digital Scholar popped up. Mm. Okay. And trust me, um, the way you've done your SEO and the way you've, uh, you know, automated uh, the automatic emails and the messages, it was so, uh, I was so impressed, definitely. So that is one of the main reasons I chose Digital Scholar because um, I felt that, you know, you, these guys have done their SEO so well, automation mm -hmm. so well, like, you know, uh, your emails were so, uh, you know, uh, well uh, designed and the video, of course, your video, I had to, I watched the video and I was really impressed with the way you uh, had automated and, um, you know, you've done your SEO. So I thought these guys are doing really well. So I'm sure uh, I'm going to learn a lot from a digital scholar. So that is when I, on spot, I, I know I uh, registered and I, uh, I got a call. Mm. I think um, within a few hours wow. of I uh, registered um, for Digital Scholar. And then I took a very immediate uh, decision. I did not you know, think. Uh, and then um, the classes had already start, started for Batch 12. So okay. I, I was, I think, um, I've missed two classes, mm -hmm. two of initial classes. But still, as like they said, the next batch is after a month. And then I said, I didn't, I don't want to waste time. So I, it's okay. Uh, they said the, the uh, chapter, the modules are already on the LMS. Mm -hmm. It's okay. You've just missed the basics. If you can, uh, you know, uh, catch up. So I said, okay, fine. Then uh, let's just get started. And I took up the installment, uh, you know, pay, uh, payment mode. And I took up two installment payment. Mode. First installment I paid. And then I started my classes. So this is the journey how I uh, came across Digital Scholar. It is, you know... I'm really glad that I came across. So I was, when I was freelancing before Digital Scholar also, I was not very confident with what I do, my mm. work. I was not, because um, I always thought that I don't have uh, enough knowledge to, uh, you know, uh, get get into the subject and you know, get clients. So I was really scared then. Mm. So after getting into Digital Scholar, one week, two weeks, three weeks into Digital Scholar, trust me, I was so confident about the subjects. Wow. Because, you know, I got a hold that, okay, fine, now I can do something uh, with digital marketing. So uh, the classes were so, um, you know, interesting and I, I, uh, I'm I, uh, you know, not an early bird. I mean, I'm, I don't wake up early and especially during a Sunday, I'm like, 
okay i mean it, i had to because the classes are obviously um, you know very interesting so so yeah this is about uh, how uh, i got i gained confidence uh, from digital scholar to become a digital marketing faculty now amazing and uh, so it's like practice what you preach right that's how that's we have made yes. digital scholar uh, our seo automations and we really want to reach out to many people and uh, all those learnings uh, we want to share with a lot of students so i don't call it as my company i call it as a research center because we do a lot of research and then we try to bring out bring it out to students no doubt now yeah so uh, <laughs> apart from uh, you know selecting digital scholar what were your favorite modules out of your entire four or five months of experience um see uh, i love seo uh, because you know uh, two things one it is very interesting uh, you have second thing you have a lot of money in seo <laughs> honestly <laughs> right because i see a lot of openings for seo a lot right. but right. Uh, yes seo is re- really interesting along with seo definitely automation because it makes life so easy for a digital marketer and during the course itself i have uh, you know i had interest towards training also mm. like you know mm. to train uh, but you know to train you need to get uh, you have you, you need to have a lot of knowledge about the subject and background which definitely i got it from digital scholar and i'm still uh, you know, on the research part where you know because now i'm a trainer like i am a faculty member who uh, where i'll be teaching digital marketing so um this is really help so my favorite subjects are seo and auto- automation and designing because i am already a canva designer so i love canva designing so even the canva designing uh, session were also really uh, amazing wow wow and how was your uh, placement uh, process so you start applying for companies how confident were you to face the questions what happened in your interview rounds can you share some insights yeah so um i might have not bagged this offer uh, through digital scholar but whatever offer i got i will definitely give credit to digital scholar because you know the, con- the the confidence what i gained after initially i did give a lot of interviews because this is my first experience giving uh, corporate interviews i've never i'm never into uh, you know this is i'm like a fresher to the corporate world or any of the agency style working whatever it is i'm a fresher i've all i, I have not worked before so um it gave me a lot of confidence to answer the questions uh, during the interview uh, processes but uh, initial first few interviews were really uh, i was really nervous because uh, obviously it was the first time and uh, i had that you know um, nervousness inside me that uh, how will i answer the questions what kind of questions might they might have they might ask me so i was really uh, nervous initially but later on as in how i uh, you know started giving interviews i became confident in this particular interview let me share one small uh, uh, you know uh, technical round of during my technical round of interview uh, for istc they asked me a question regarding uh, government policies like okay. uh, yeah so um, i remember your class where you thought us about the sms blast where you know you had mentioned about uh mm. you know the government policies like you're not supposed to use certain words and you know you you have to stick so that really that came into my mind and you know i i was for like obviously for 15 seconds i was like a little blank and then you know suddenly i remember that you uh, i remember your class and i i started to answer so you i mean that was see again you that helped me a lot in my interview wow. so that was one of one of the major questions during my technical round and i had i uh, i easily cracked it amazing amazing and um, um so what was the package you cracked uh so uh 5 lakh 1000 is my package which i'm really happy as a fresher wow. a, i i feel it's a really a uh, good package for a fresher like me amazing. so yeah that's my amazing package. so uh, so ultimately you're very happy uh, about yes, it yes i am and happy most important and confident super happy and confident that's important and uh, do you like your job profile because you said yes, you are into very much because so you... it's just you know i have already uh, started uh, working as well but it's just uh, you know two days of my uh, work but i uh, haven't explored yet but the roles and responsibilities what they've given me are very interesting it mm-hmm. is it is you know going to be around digital marketing only like digital marketing and the all the aspects so that is one thing which i'm very happy that i'm going to um you know uh, get what like what i've learned i can you know um 
uh, showcase my skills and you know uh, pass on the learnings to uh, you know students so yes awesome awesome and um so what are you going to basically uh, like one final word that you would want to say to students who wants to join digital uh, scholar or who wants to take up digital marketing what's your uh, learning yeah. out of the entire four months so digital marketing is going to be one of the booming industries uh, you know uh, coming now there are going to be a lot of uh, uh, you know uh, opportunities uh, in the digital marketing field. So it is a very great opportunity to get certified as a digital marketer and from digital scholar because they, because not they, you give hands-on experience with all the practical knowledge, not only theory, like, you know, anybody can, uh, you know, teach theory, anybody can just, you know, deliver PPTs and just go on and say, but the practical experience along with the assignments and, you know, uh, and relevant assignments, like whatever we, we are taught, uh, we have to do it practically. So this will definitely, uh, you know, uh, help you with, you know, uh, getting into the digital marketing career, which is definitely going to boom. That's that's my take on uh, Amazing. digital marketing and digital scholar. Superb. Thank you very much for that. And uh, yes, this is going to be your work from home job, right? No, no, no. This is the work from office. Work from office based out of Bangalore. Yes. Yes, also because I'll have to go to the colleges and deliver uh, the wow. lectures. So awesome. this is going to be work from office. Great. We would like to host you sometime for a lecture at Digital Scholar. Nothing better than having sure, a that would be That would be, uh, you know, an honor, <laughs> I would say. And also, um, I would like to mention, this is in my head that, you know, once a digital scholar, always a digital scholar. So I am hoping for a long-term connection with digital scholars so that I gain a lot of, uh, you know, knowledge Definitely. from digital scholar because I am a digital scholar. Superb. And as we said, we are digital scholars and we are awesome, right? Yes. We are always we are going awesome. to be awesome in our lives. Awesome. Yes. Awesome, Sarah. Lovely, lovely having you and thank you for choosing us and thank you for doing so awesome. We are so glad and thrilled that, uh, you know, you are happy and that's most important yes. because at the end of the day, for us, of course, it is a business, but ultimately for us, uh, when students win, that's the that gives us more happiness than anything else. Yes, right? thank you. Thank so you. Much. Thank you very much. Take care. Me. See you very soon. Thank you so much.